A quarter of the world's population is now living under some form of lockdown due to coronavirus. More than three billion people in almost 70 countries and territories have been asked to stay at home. I guess this won't be so bad. I have some time to do things I like. I get to read some new books. Catch up on my favorite series. Chill out and listen to music. Cook all my favorite meals. But then I saw this. I'm stuck inside now. But what if I could never get out? But this isn't my life. For these animals, confinement is their whole life. Minks and foxes are forced into tiny cages, often alone. Cold, hard metal cages with no space to move around. They will never feel the earth beneath their paws. They suffer this for years until the day they are killed for humans to wear their skin. This is the fur industry. Pigs live their entire lives in farms, deprived of their natural instincts to explore and dig. They are raised until they are big enough to make the farmer maximum profit. They are still babies when they reach this size. They are bred and raised to be slaughtered for their flesh. This is the meat industry. Chickens are crammed in cages with barely any space to move around. They are exploited for their eggs until they are physically destroyed and then killed for their flesh. This is the egg and meat industry. Baby cows are separated from their mothers in the dairy industry. They cannot drink the milk that is meant for them because humans take it. They are denied their mother's love and they're sent to confinement, often all alone. They cry for their mothers. The males are killed as babies, and the females will suffer a life full of exploitation. This is the dairy and meat industry. This is their whole life. They won't get freedom after the lockdown, because they never had freedom. They only have suffering and confinement. Their misery will continue as long as we purchase animal products. We have a choice. We can change this for the animals. <laughs>